Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, since I didn't really know what to film, I'm just going to do writing vlogs and show you guys kind of what I write. Um, now I apologize for my messy room if you see any part of it. I do need to clean that. Um, and my dog's on my bed. See, I don't make my bed because of that. Um, she likes to lay on my bed and mess it up. So, what I'm currently working on is actually two books now. Um, I don't care what I look like at all right now. I just changed my shirts and I'm still wearing these very comfortable leggings that my mom got me at Ross. And the patterns are horrible. But, they are very comfortable and soft. And that's what I like to go with when I write. Um, I plan on reading more of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone right here. I am on chapter... I'm rereading it. This is not my first time reading it. I'm on chapter 4. And Harry is learning about his parents and who he really is. So, I am actually working on two books right now. Like I already said. And the first one you've heard a lot about, which is my main fantasy book called Zamora. And I mostly write fantasy. I am planning, or I have a contemporary novel in this notebook. I said, yeah, that's the right one. Um, that is the title of it. And this is where I am. I Last night I stayed up until 3 just to write this one scene um right here and actually I wrote like a little I wrote a little more than that but I wrote that one scene which is pretty much the very first kissing scene um it's a little bit of a kiss scene between the main character and his best friend's twin sister um, but I don't know if I regret that. No, you know what, I, I'm going to keep that in because it will help Griffin's character. Um, and then I also started my book. I'll give you a little tour of it. I only have five pages right now. I'm slowly working on it because I'm trying to figure everything out as I go. It's been in my head for three months, um, since September, and I wanted to write this so bad, so I started writing this, um, do I have a date on here? December 5th, I started writing it, so only a few days ago. Um, I forget what day... December 5th was on, but this is the title for Mercy's Door, or the title page, and then I have this quote, which is the very first line from Sean Mendez's, Shawn Mendez's song on Mercy, which actually fits so well with the entire book, so that's why I have that there. I was going to do a quote for each chapter, but then I'm like, I'm gonna run out of a song before I run out of the run out of chapters. And then how I decided to do my chapter headings was put the character name um on the side. So I have Leaf right here and he is my first character. Then I have chapter one which is called The Blood War. And it's literally this long. And then we go to his sister who is at the castle while he's at the war. Um, Serafina, and this is chapter two, and this is all that I've written for chapter two, but I am very excited. I was going to have two chap- or, yeah, two chapters for each character, but then I thought, eh, and these are going to be a lot shorter chapters. They may get longer throughout editing, but I'm kind of excited for it right now, and I like, well, I, I'm obsessed with that font because it looks medieval time and that's kind of where this setting is. And I'm excited for Serafina's character. 
because it's great. So how I'm doing this is I have a whole family of siblings. One of them doesn't know that the others are her family because she was taken away. And then I have, um, so I have Leaf, who is the first character. Then I have Serafina, who is the second second character, um, who is his older sister, and she's the one that has the twin that got taken by her mother, um, who is actually a witch, and there's also going to be a point of view from the witch's side, um, and she is, she is called Lyra Gudrun. And Serafina's sister, to her, is called Astrid Gendron, but I'm also going to have her be named a different name, which I'm not going to reveal right now. Um, but there's going to be her, Astrid's point of view, up until she realizing, right, realizes who she is, and then she's pretty much a completely different person, um, or the same person, just with a different, different name. And she's also a part of Serafina and Leaf's family. Um, and then they have Lorenzo, who is the oldest son of the Valdemir family. And then I have an evil character who's kind of like my Negan, my own Negan character. Um, who's called Racin Magnus. And I am so freaking excited to write him. I mentioned him in both chapters because Serafina is actually going, she was in love with him, um, she still kind of is, and he's from a land called, let me get my notebook out, I'm not going to show you everything in this notebook, uh, Dristan, Dristan, um, a land called, well actually not a land, it's still in the same country, it's just across the country. Um, Nazora and Arcilia is the kingdom that the Valdemir's rule, or Valdemir's rule. Um, and, I don't know, Serafina, she's coming in sl slowly, and I'm already starting to love her character. I came up with it at, like, 3 a.m. last night, or in the realization last night. Give me a hug. Hi, baby. Hi. Oh, you can't see her. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, that is um pretty much the book so far. I only have two chapters with two characters. That is a younger brother and an older sister, and I'm really excited to read this book. Um, again, this is also the first draft, so yeah, I am really excited because I'm going to pretty much ruin Leaf's life. Um, and Lorenzo, I actually named after Lorenzo Henry, um, who played Chris in Fear the Walking Dead. I don't know their last names, but um, he played him in Fear the Walking Dead. He's also in um, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., which I haven't read. I watched a little bit of last night's episode, or I think it was last night's episode, but I also just love how I'm doing the letters. It's kind of inspired by Rick Riordan's um, The King Chronicles, which I want to get back to so badly because I love the Egyptian gods and goddesses, and, or the Egyptians, um, mythology, along with the Greek mythology, so maybe after I reread Harry Potter, I will reread that, and yeah, so that's, that's a little thought of how right now is going, and yeah, so I am still on chapter 9, I think, let me look. It's literally so long. Wait. 
I write really long paragraphs. This is all in one chapter, by the way. There we go, chapter 9, the Tr Trisco family, which is probably one of my favorite families um, I've ever created, because I have created a couple of other ones. Um, not including the one that I'm writing now, but also, like, for, I'm creating families for books that I haven't written yet. Um, just because I've been working on Zamora. I started, um, actually I started another book that I'm not going to tell you too much about because it's kind of a secret project, or I'm calling it a secret project. I've only told three of my, well, one of my family members, um, my grandma on my dad's side, and then I told my best friend Melissa and Savannah. That's all that I'm told about this idea, um, because it's kind of taken from a, something that happened in my childhood, um, or, it's from a friend's friendship from my childhood, um, uh, or inspired by that, and I'm also excited to write that because it's like a contemporary mystery story, so yeah, this is where I'm at now, and I'll, I don't know, ooh, I want to show you, we decorated yesterday for Christmas, and I'm so excited, Edward is just going to stay on my bed. Let's turn on some lights so that you can actually see. So, I love decorating and I decorated. I have a little sand. Oh no, we're gonna came out here. I decorated all up there. This is pretty much where we always put. Oh, I need to put a Santa up there because we have a ton of little Santas. And then we have that right there. And as you can see, it has been raining all day. I actually woke up at one, but it's been raining all day and it's so cloudy outside. So I'm gonna be writing and I also set this up. I cleared it all off and I put my dad's, my mom and dad's writing photo there, my beautiful parents. Um, and then a snow globe that actually has me and Ash in here is a snow globe and I love it. You have had this forever. Same as that candle and that candle, all of those candles. But then we also have that which I love and I have had a sandal on that side. And I'll show you. I put our picture up here and then another Santa. Like we have a ton of different kinds of these Santas. And then there's my dog again. I'm gonna turn on the hall light so that you can see a little better. But I got to put all the presents under the tree or Ash helped bring them over. And there's the Christmas tree. I love it so much. We just decorated it with all of our ornaments. This one is an aerial one and some has a bell in the middle and I love it so much especially with this one with the angels and baby Jesus I got that from church and hey you can see me in that light bulb <laughs> what? what do you see Ripley? what do you see? and then she came um, those are the gift game gifts, and there are two presents that my dad got me that I'm pretty sure I know what they are. They feel like bricks. Um, I know they're not bricks, but they feel heavy. Oh, there's one for, actually those two are both for me. Um, but they feel like bricks, and I want to show you something also. So there's this, but this is an artificial tree, um, not a real one. So oh, pretty. Oh, there's one with the wise men, the three wise men, and baby Jesus as well. I just love these ornaments. We got these from young women's, and I 
want to just love them because they are gorgeous. We have so many stuff with, or so much stuff with sand on it. It changes colors when you press the button. Oh, and also, also, is that the one? Yep. Let's. Look at that. It changes colors. Or it changes from white to that. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Someday I want to film videos on this couch when no one is here. And I have to put all those boxes back in the garage. But it's really cold outside. Oh, look at my dog. Ridley. 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 Are you a good girl? I just love it. I'm gonna change it back now. Back to what now? There we go. Oh, I got hair in my eyes. Oh, and I put our stockings out. That one's mine. Although, we don't really have... Um, we don't do stockings anymore. And we have glue in them. Um, also what's funny is I haven't even told my parents what I wanted for Christmas. Like, a few books I told them that I wanted. And they're telling me that they already got, like... Kind of stuff for me, and they're so excited. Um, I'm kind of excited for my dad's present because I feel like I know what they are because we actually went or you no, know, I feel like I know what they are. Got the three keys. She knows. She heard me open the box. Oh, come on. You want a treat? Oh, look how good she is. There you go. Good girl. I need you a rascal too. Hi, Blake. Do you want one too? I'll give you one too. No, Rickley, you already got one. No. Here you go. You just got one, baby. She's like, are you going to give me another one? No. No. This just looks so much better though because it was piled with crap and stuff and photos, which I put all on here. And we also have this thing right here. So our house is looking very festive, festive along with yet another Santa. Um, I swear we have... Have you guys read Paper Towns? I don't know if you guys have read or seen Paper Towns, but... Um, Quentin's best friend. I for I'm forgetting his name, but I love the book. Here, let me go, my friend. Come on, Rizzy. Here, I'm gonna stop this clip and then start another one so that this doesn't end up being 20 minutes long by itself. Come on, come on. Woo. So I'm gonna go and then come back. So another quick little update, it's not that dressed, um, because I think I'm going to do a small little workout indoors, and I'm so annoyed because I'm trying to watch Camry enjoy vlogs, but, and I love her by the way, um, and you should watch her if you're looking for someone new, um, it's being completely slow, just, just, what, like, like left, left, and then my brain just subconsciously went left. So now where are you going? Okay, it's... So irritated. Okay, well, not right now, but it was being really slow and really annoying. And it's like I just want to watch the video and even trying to go to a different window. Oh, I wonder what's on TV. I have Xfinity up on here because that's what we have now. Um, oh, Ellen. 
Watch. Watch, Ellen. I missed like half the show, or almost half the show. I love watching Ellen DeGeneres. Although, sometimes I don't watch much YouTube, or I don't watch much TV. I watch more YouTube now. I don't care about that commercial. And it's not a recording, so I can't go back um, or go forward. But I love watching Ellen DeGeneres. Okay, this is just a short little clip. Um, I don't know. Oh, did I press something? No. I thought I pressed something. I don't know how often I'll do vlog. Oh. Oh, yeah. Jack almost struck my lip balm on the ground. Another thing, this necklace right here. Can you see it? Yeah, you can see it. Um, this necklace I got from my grandparents when they went on a trip, I think, to Hawaii. And I know Ash got one too. It's a red one somewhere. Um, I was planning to have a black cord, but Ash wouldn't let me have the black cord. So I got the green one, and since there's a rose on it, Ash thought that the green one would look better. So we went with green. And this is actually the necklace that both of the twins have, or that the twins in my story, Mercy's Door, has to represent, or it's to let people know that they are, is it back on? Oh, well, Smith, is that it? Sir? Oh, I want to see this movie so bad. It has Will Smith, um, Kate Winslet, Meryl Streep. It has so many people in it. And I recognize, and I so want to see it. Hey, look. Will Smith and Elvin. Oh, I'm so jealous. I so want to see that so bad. That's like one of my movie, anticipated movies. So it's bigger. <laughs> He's freaking out. Okay, so I am so freak. I'm so going to go see that movie. Um, first of all, I love Will Smith, and I love half of that cast. So I just have to go see that. It's one of my most anticipated movies of the year. And, oh, wait, does it come out this year or next year? I don't know. Um, 
Also, Star Wars Rogue Run, which my dad already got the tickets for, literally at 9 o'clock when they went on sale, or the night that they went on sale, which I think was sometime last week, him and his best friend, um, Scott, who, where our family is going and his family is going, um, he has three boys that I've known since they were born, I think, um, and... Yeah, so, my, we're Star Wars nerds, um, I'm not as big as one as my dad is, but with it coming back and with Harry Potter coming back, um, they're like the two best fandoms out there right now, still, and I'm happy to be rereading Harry Potter. I'm going to end this clip before it this vlog ends up being so much. Hopefully later tonight it will be more interesting. Um, I think I'm gonna watch this episode of Ellen and then do my workout and then get in the shower and yeah. Or film or no. I don't know. I'll let you know later. Yeah, that, that, that's all I have right now. Okay, I'm back. So, I don't know if you guys have read Paper Towns by John Green. If you have, let me know. I absolutely loved that book. Read it over the summer. Um, do I have it on my little... Yep, I have it on my little um, books I read in 2016 list. Which I think I'm going to put in my journal. Um, anyways, so I feel like we are Quentin's best friends. Um, oh, the names... Best friend's parents. I'm seeing the character in my head where they collect all the black Santas. Um, except we just have a ton of Santas, including on the tree. We have a ton of Santas. Um, yeah, we, we just have so much. Or so many Santas. It's crazy. I. No, no, oh, I need to finish watching this. I'm watching Cambria and Joy's, um, Vlogmas, and, yeah, I think I may just do writing vlogs and add them to my channel, um, because I do like doing vlogs in my room, even though it's messy, and I apologize for that, um, I'm going to work on cleaning that today. I woke up around 1 or two because I stayed up until three which my mom kind of got mad at me for um she kept telling me to go to bed every time I came out here or came out there um but I wanted to write that kissing scene which I was kind of awkward for and it was kind of actually no it wasn't my first kissing scene my first kissing scene was in GSS um my contemporary novel this is probably going to be the only kissing scene within, um, Zamora, or at least this book, and in the other ones, I don't know, I may have Griffin meet someone new because I'm going to end up killing her off, um, and funny fact, Melissa is actually named after my best friend, who is also named Melissa, and we've been best friends for like eight years or something. And when I told her when she got back from her mission, I was telling her about my writing and my books, and, uh, she got, like, mad that I killed her off, and I'm like, okay, I wouldn't have killed her off if she didn't have a purpose for it later on. And she doesn't really have any purpose. She was made for being able to kill her. And... It's kind of in a horrible way. I, it's a more mild, horrible way. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna. Okay, it's still recording. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just, <laughs> I killed her off so that the other characters can have like their breaking points. 
Um, which I think, did I do a video on that already? I don't know. My computer is being so slow today. I wonder if it's the weather doing that and messing with the internet. Or it's just the internet. So maybe I'll stick with Microsoft Office today. today because the weather, uh, and I want to maybe film and upload a video. Not on this camera, because whenever I film on this camera, I, I just like being able to see myself. Like, if I'm vlogging, that's fine. But, filming an actual video, I like filming on here. Just because it's a lot easier to film on here, and it's a lot easier to find the videos and upload them, and or edit them. And I... I don't know, my computer is just being very slow. Even while watching Good Mythical Morning, it was being kind of slow, and I need to watch Good Mythical more as well. Yeah. So, that's just all I have for this little clip. Oh. Is it her? Oh, I woke her up. <laughs> Go back to sleep, Mama. soon hey guys so it's a little later on it's like 5 p.m. now and it's really dark outside and see that's what I mean when I say that only one of my lights is working um, those two are out so if in a video I say that none of my lights are working that's why and the one that is working is pointing that way. Um, so yeah, that's why I, my lighting on my la laptop, which is down there now, um, is terrible and that's why it's so dark on this side. Besides the pretty lights that I put up there. Um, that's the only thing that I've cleaned off in my room. I need to clean up my desk. So this is kind of like a before video or a before clip of my room um before I clean it and I'm going to start I'm gonna film me starting to clean my room and I haven't really done anything to myself today except for brushing my hair just now um just because it's a lazy, rainy day, and there's buzz, a little bit buzzes on there. Um, yeah, so a quick another pan around the room, and hopefully in an hour or two, it will be clean. And I'm also going to be listening to some music. I'm hoping to find Pentatonic's Christmas album on Spotify. Because I love pentatonics and I want to listen to them. So I'm going to do that and then I'll film a little bit of me cleaning in the beginning before I turn on the music. Because I don't want any copyrights uh, um, popping up when I try to upload this. And yeah, we'll see how this goes. I've been meaning to clean my room. Sorry, I had it. Ah, I'm pressing the button with my fingers. Um, I've been meaning to do this for weeks. Um, for a while at least but it's just one of those things that you need to do and you procrastinate and I'm a procrastinator and with cleaning my room at least um so that's what I'm doing right now or I'm going to be doing after I turn on Spotify if it works um and yeah, nothing, nothing else really there. Oh no, okay. I keep pressing the button so that I have my hand on this side. Um. Anyways, 
So, how are you guys doing? Let me know what, how you're doing and what you're doing down below. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you want more videos like this or other videos like writing or music or booktube related stuff. Um, yeah. So let me let me know how life is going for you guys. It's going great for me, especially since it's starting to feel a lot more like Christmas. Since we decorated the pretty much decorated the tree yesterday and my mom and grandma had wrapped all of, all of the presents um yesterday, so I'm really excited for Christmas. I have no idea what to expect out of what I'm getting because they keep telling me that they get got me stuff like my mom would come home from shopping and be and when I get up she'll be like I just got you something new or I just got you another present for Christmas you're so gonna love it and knowing my mom she pretty much knows what I like and stuff like that so I I have no idea I think I said something about Harry Potter or Walking Dead and she's like, what, you think you're getting something from those two franchises for Christmas? And I'm like, I have no idea. I don't know what I'm getting because I never gave them a list. And she said to give them a list but I never gave them one and now I'm stuck here wondering and... See, I like surprises but then I don't like surprises. This is probably going to be a long vlog, so I apologize for that, and I don't even know what I'm going to call it. Probably writing and rainy day, because it was supposed to be just a writing vlog where I give you updates on my room. But, I decided to change that a little bit. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go do that, and... I don't, I, I don't know what else to say here. <laughs> um, yeah, my room just needs a clean and vacuum and dusting and all of that good stuff. So I'm gonna go do that right after I find pentatonics. Hey guys, so since this vlog is probably going to be uh, close to 30 minutes long and I'm just going to be writing the rest of the day and this was supposed to be just a writing vlog where I just give you updates and stuff like that um, I did clean up the clothes over there in the corner of my room then I got distracted by food because I've only had cereal today so I got um, leftovers from last night and then I started writing Mercy Story again after watching a writing video. Um, yeah, so I'm going to continue writing Mercy's Door. I'm probably switching between that and Zamora. And just call this a night right here. It's about... It's almost 7 o'clock. Um... But yeah, I, I just want to end this vlog right here with, with a quick little ending. Um, it's probably not going to be quick at all. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos over here. And if you want to watch more of my videos, I'll leave them right here. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in another video soon. Probably tomorrow because I'm gonna actually vlog tomorrow along with writing. I'm like combining writing vlogs with regular daily vlogs now um, just because I get think it's a lot better than just doing a um, quick little video of something. So you know what? I I'm gonna say goodnight and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!